Ted, tell us about this uh, project you came up with. Well, I think that's, that's a fairly succinct answer to well the question. Said. Yeah, well said, well said. Uh, actually, I got the idea after Dr. Rico interviewed Mel Lee okay. uh, on the radio. Oh. And he was talking about collaboration. Okay. All and right. uh, I thought, mm, good idea. What, I what, mean, what, uh, and what, what is the idea? The idea was that a couple of us would collaborate. And How come so you included for, him? I don't know. I, oh, okay. Well, it's just because he's Mr. Snaps. <laughs> um, that's, that's the reason why I included him. Oh, okay. I thought that uh, he'd be a good guy to yeah. have. Yeah. Actually, so, I want my name to be Stingo. Stingo, Mr. Stingo? No, just Stingo. Oh, no. Stingo. It has to be Mr. Stingo? So. Stinko? Now, wait. Stinko? Stingo. Stingo. You don't get to decide if it's Mr. Oh. or not. <laughs> Wrong. Ted, Ted tell, us, tell us what the project's going to be. Uh, I just thought that... Uh, <clears throat> the way you envision it. Okay, the way I envisioned the project was that the three of us would get together, uh, thinking about your skills, about my skills, and about Scott's skills, and uh, that we could do three collaborative pieces. I didn't think that they would be sculptural. I thought they'd be mostly painting. And then we'd have, when we did a show with the... Uh, uh, with the work, that we'd have each of our, we'd, we'd show some of our individual wall piece work, 2D. Mm. And that this work would be 2D that we're yeah. going to be doing. Now, and <clears throat> I've been overruled already, so it's like, and I ask you to do it, and you said, <laughs> And you were amenable to it, and right. so was Scott. And, and uh, you, you consider this a very serious collaboration? Obvi obviously. Absolutely. Okay. I am absolutely serious about art. Scott, what, what was your reaction when he approached you? Well, I thought um, it's, I think it's an interesting idea, and I think it has a lot of possibilities. I think it's going to be hard for us to work on three pieces and end up with three good pieces. Um, part of why I want to do it is I want to learn from you guys. Um, what do you think you're going to learn from us guys? Technique. Technique of? How to apply objects to canvases and how to make it work together. And oh, you mean, so you, you really, and, and when I envisioned this, I didn't envision a 3D part of the project. Yeah. But you have envisioned a 3D? Well, I'm just talking about it like catching a photograph, even. Yeah. Well, we, we still haven't determined what we're going to do. What we're going to do, I think, is, is gather some, some materials together and, and do just lay them on the floor and see how it works. That's to, what I'm thinking. To begin with. I mean, yeah. you know, as an initial assault on, on all of it. So... It could be anything. Objects. Could be objects, could be just flat work. I mean, I, I think we should stay open to everything. Just get get going, I think, is the main thing. And and and, and see what our what our reactions are to everybody else. So doing. I'm not sure how you how do you envision this collaboration working? I think we should gather some stuff we think would work, materials. Objects. Each, like we bring, each bring stuff to the to the situation, such as what, whatever whatever turns your cork. I mean, you know, uh, if it's something you want to play with, bring it. We'll play with it. Well, if you're talking about actual objects, I'm thinking about photographs. I'm thinking about some wood things that I've made and that I might put on. I'm not sure it would work. Um, I'm, you know, I'm concerned about how you take three different people's points of view and somehow blend that into a single piece of art that makes sense. I think that's going to be the difficult part. Right. Now my skill is not painting or drawing, and so I'm, I doubt that I'm going to do a lot of painting and drawing. 
So I'm going to bring my skills to the situation. What are your skills? Photography. Working with wood. And, and that's all you expect to do? No, I'm not doing that. No. In fact, I want to learn from you guys and try different things. Well, that's again. What, what are you going to learn? Well, how to attach things to a canvas, how to blend things. Now, I think Rich has these skills where well, he well, can Rich have. Is a Rich has these He's skills. Rich has these skills, and yeah. that I don't have, and I think I can learn something from him and in, in, uh, watching him do things. Well, how is that then part of, of a collaboration? That's his part. My part is learning. Yeah. And do part, no, my part is, uh, you're is trying to work. to work my photographs in with your paintings, and I would hope that you would try to work your painting in with my photographs, somehow make that come together. So when I was talking to you about this, I mentioned uh, uh, Andy Warhol, uh, uh, Sean uh, Basquiat, right. and uh, Clemente. Yeah. And um, did, did you look that up on? Uh, I have the book. Oh, you got a book? Where did you get? You had the book? I have it. Did you steal it? No. <laughs> it's a Basquiat book. <laughs> Oh, and it, it explains the uh, the collaboration that they did. Uh, so no, when no, I was, a little bit. When I was um, um, envisioning this, as you were asking, I was envisioning something on the order of what they did, which would be you do your own work, the other guy does his own work, maybe somebody then comes in and goes over the work that you're doing, or that somebody else has done, and uh, it's... So you're not seeing the collaboration as, as being a discussion and trying to figure out how to do things together. You're seeing it as one person works on it, and then the next person works on it. Yeah, or all three of you work on it at the same time. And it's just like you just... action. But I am open to getting objects Mm -hmm. I mean, it, that's what collaboration is all about, right? That's I mean, right. To, not just to impose your point of view on uh, on the other people. I think I think I think that's all all well and good as as long as I'm the fi final arbiter of, of what's good. Uh, really? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You know. So, how did you uh, get that uh, job? It's uh, um, I think it's accepted. By both of you, that, that I have the best taste. No, right? it's not accepted by me. Now, is this going to be in the in the video? This part here. <laughs> this, this, <laughs> this may get edited. Yeah, yeah. It might. We bring a whole lot of crap here and we throw it on the floor, and what? We, with the thing, it's and called, move it's it around and stuff like that. I, I've actually done that. I found it boring. Okay. I mean, I, I went to a workshop and did that. Well, with this just, guy. Who, yeah. That's you know the guy who did that, those big um, um, figures no, in uh, front of the Betcher place, the uh, like white figures that elongated? Yes, the Gumby, Gumby Bear. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Well, he's full of crap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I thought so. But he's like a big name guy I who he makes yes. a lot of money. Well, there's, that, that means nothing. Actually, okay, all right. This is an unknown. We don't know how we're going to work together. We don't know what direction we're going at this point. Right. So my take is we play, and if we if we lose that quality and and uh, intention of playing with this thing, it's not going to be any fun. Okay. I, agree. I don't. I think we can get overly serious and, and. I agree with that. And and you know I want to have I want to have a good result. We got we got to learn. To work with each other. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, so, so that's my take. You know. We have to play well with others. Is that Absolutely, and run with scissors. <laughs> yeah. Very important. <laughs> More or less. What do you think? Well, play is not a word that I use. All right. Well, but, but, what, but but give me a word. But, give, give me a word. I'm working on it. Okay. Um, what a dictionary. <laughs> um, <laughs> Uh, experience, you know, I'm, I'm open to experiences, and that's what I want to do here. I want to, I want to kind of tap into you guys and your energy, 
and how you think about making art. And I want to, like I said before, kind of learn from that and understand that. And maybe that'll help me um, when I'm making things. If, you know, I can kind of apply that to how I do. So the idea of getting a bunch of stuff together, I think that's a good idea. Yeah. I think we work I like that. I like that aspect and that approach that, yeah. that we are going to, through our involvement with each other, we're going to learn a lot. Yeah. Yeah. And that's a good thing. <laughs> well, God, you know that's that's the most important thing in the world, though, is is when when we're kids, is is we accept our playfulness and our imagination and can retain that as we grow. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I agree with that. Okay. Well, I put but that I, a little I mean, different way. But putting crap on the floor and moving it around seems. A there's little, see, see, no, there's there's no, another way of verbalizing that. Right. You know. You're saying putting crap on the floor, that's yeah. such a negative connotation. Yeah, well, I, We're going to right. each bring them in objects that are of interest to us, that we think have the potential of coming together with something that you might bring in, yeah. and try to work with it. Right, and see if it works. And it's no different than, than putting it on a fixed canvas. You know, it's the floor, it's a, it's a space. So, and we're going to glue this stuff to the... Uh, the surface of the screw and screw, screw, screw and screw, paste, uh, paint. So it, it's throw like, glitter at it. So we have some fun. So could we put like a simulated rocket in the middle of the? You thing? could do anything you want. Right? To. Really? Okay. Yeah. This rocket. is this is going to be. I'm going to do a rocket. Phone. See, I, I just wouldn't do expect a, that you would do, do a robot. I want to do a robot Fine. in the middle. Fine. A metal robot. Yeah. If. If that's what you think is going to work, kind of in your mind, yeah, then I might try to work with you on that. That's a collaboration. Okay. I also do freelance clown work. I, I just want to let you know. That's just don't let. Oh, they're listening. Okay, no mind. <laughs> you do freelance edits because you're the uh, circus emperor. Yeah, I'm not using that moniker though. <laughs> no, I'm coming up with something like Zingo. 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 No, I'm Zingo. <laughs> oh, you're Zingo. Uh, and so Zingo is like a circus freak. Uh, I wouldn't put it that way. I would say a performer. Oh, and, and we and, digress. So remember, Mel has a busy day. <laughs>